A couple's dream wedding turned into a nightmare. Pyrotechnics igniting the ceiling of the venue during the first dance. The bride and groom fleeing the flames along with some of their guests. But many didn't get out in time. The blaze ripping through the venue, leaving more than 90 people dead and dozens more hurt. <laughs> this nun, who lives in a monastery nearby, saying bodies are being taken out, use were flooding into the hall to get out the largest number of people they could. Emergency crews rushing the injured to a nearby hospital. <laughs> the wards full of victims. <laughs> this Iraqi health official saying the majority of the victims were completely burned. Daylight revealing the extent of the destruction. Drone footage shows the wedding hall's roof collapsed. Inside the building, a charred and mangled mess. Mounds of twisted metal rising from the floor of the building. Mama! Mama! <laughs> this man making an unthinkable discovery in the rubble, the burned remains of his mother's clothing. Officials announcing nine people who worked at the venue have been arrested in connection to the fire. <laughs> this investigator saying the pyrotechnics used in the ceremony were not allowed inside or outside the venue. <laughs> As family and friends carry out the solemn task of mourning the dead, hundreds of people gathering for funeral processions. <laughs> A day supposed to be filled with celebration turned into tragedy. <laughs> Matt Bradley, NBC News. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.